Hello everybody, this is Arathus and welcome to a new game for the channel. Today we are going to give Warhammer 40k Inquisitor Martyr uh, a try. Now, for those of you who aren't aware of the game, it is an early access title on that was just released on Steam, I believe August 31st. I'm not 100% positive on that, but I believe that's when it was released. And I am just now getting to it, but I've been wanting to play it ever since I found out about it because, well, one, it's a 40k game. So, yeah, oh, I love the lore, I love the style of everything about 40k. And two, it is a action RPG, kind of like some of the descriptions I heard of this game basically say a Diablo-style game in the 40k universe. And all of that just makes me excited because... I love Diablo, I love the 40k universe, and I love action RPGs. So, there we have it. Uh, also, again, because it is an early access game, please bear in mind that, you know, as always, all the features aren't in the game, and it could be a little buggy. Uh, also, if you want to check the game out, I will put a link in the description below. Because, and also, one of the things I do like about this early access title is if you go to check it out on Steam, the developers have actually put out a very detailed roadmap as to everything they are going to do between now and release and the milestones showing exactly when they are going to release those features or at least try to release those features. Uh, one of the reasons that I jumped on it now is that in October they're going to be, I believe it's October, if not October, maybe early November, I'll have to double check, but they're going to be adding the beginning portion of the single player campaign, so that should be friggin' awesome. But either way, enough jabbering, let's create our character and get into it. I think we're going to start with a Crusader. Before rising to the rank of Inquisitor, you served as a Crusader, the holy warrior of the Adeptus Ministorum. Crusaders display their devotion to the Emperor as honor guards or executioners, and such is the zeal of the Crusaders that it makes them ideal recruits for the Inquisition. Inquisitors with the Crusader background are fearsome warriors using heavy armor and weaponry. On the battlefield, they relentlessly march through fire like the legendary juggernauts of the old Terran myths. They are the slowest of the three agent archetypes, trading mobility for protection and firepower. Well, there you go. We can... Purge the heretics with superior firepower. Crusaders must spend focus points to operate power armor and heavy weapon skills. I have no idea what focus points are. Uh, melee specialist. Only crusaders are capable of wielding shields and heavy melee weapons. Okay. And power armor. Crusaders are permitted to wear power armor so they can soak up a tremendous amount of damage. Interesting. Let's just for fun look at the next one up. Before becoming Inquisitor, you served the Imperium as a death cult assassin. A specialist of deceit who expresses her worship through death. Death cults can be found on many Imperial worlds, paying their tithe to the Emperor with the culling of heretics, traitors, and other enemies of mankind. Inquisitors with the death cult background are deadly assassins, experts in hit and run tactics, and exotic weapons. In combat, they rely on their acrobatic skills and speed, thus preferring lighter armor and weapons. That doesn't sound very 40k like, well, not Imperium 40k. I know, I know, Imperium, the Imperium does have, you know, inquisitorial assassins and the like, but, I mean, come on, the first thing that comes to your mind when you think of, you know, 40k aren't the lithe, agile humans, you know, usually you reserve that for, like, the Eldar and the Dark Eldar, or whatever the hell they're going to be called, um, or that they, that their names got changed to in the most recent lore thing, update, whatever. Still. Anyway, let's go ahead and read through here. Adrenaline. Assassin Inquisitors must spend adrenaline points to dodge, use exotic weapons, and armor skills. Due to their status and training, Inquisitors with a Death Cult background can use even the most exotic war gear from the Imperial Arsenal. And they can dodge, regardless of the armor that they wear. Now, don't get me wrong, the Death Cult Assassin sounds badass. But, since we've never played this game, let's maybe go with one that has heavy armor, a character that has heavy armor so that we don't, you know, it's a little bit more forgiving so we don't die quickly and early. Of course, we are going to name our first character Arathas. And damn, this would be my choice right here without a question if it was available, the Psyker class. 
Okay, Juggernaut. Holy shit, that looks cool. Chainsword, Greatsword, and Suppression Shield. The Juggernaut Crusader is the master of hand-to-hand -hand combat, wielding chainsword and suppression shield, or the two-handed energy-infused greatsword. Okay, all that sounds amazing. Cutting through several enemies at the same time, or mitigating incoming damage with shocking efficiency. A power armor equipped with a light but effective jump pack. Ooh! So he could basically be an assault marine. The wearer is capable of making long jumps across the battlefield and deal impact damage at arrival. The powerful ability can also be used for offensive and defensive purposes alike. It is also equipped with a refractor field generator. I'm not familiar with whatever that was. But come on, you can't... I mean, look at that. That is just... That is just really damn cool. I wish I could rotate it. Maybe I can. Nope. Assault gunner. Ooh, a dual wielding... That That's cool, too. Not as cool... I mean, this is, like more impressive at first glance but the assault gunner's pretty cool last pistol and auto gun the assault gunner takes the fight to the enemy wielding the common but versatile ranged weapons of the imperium they can be used for devastating burst fire and precise aimed shots alike depending on the situation in ancient power armor the sentinel armor sorry is an ancient power armor variant equipped with a sophisticated tactical cogitator and a teleport beacon system the wielder can summon automated tarantula turrets from the dropship in orbit and wreak terrible havoc upon the enemy. Also equipped with a stun mine dispenser. Ooh, I like the the tarantula turrets. Ooh, damn! Wow! Holy shit! Okay, I like this one too. Damn it! This is gonna be difficult. Shotgun and Laz Gun. The heavy weapon specialist starts out with common Imperial armament, unlocking more potent weapons of mass destruction later down the path. The shotgun is an ancient tool for close quarters butchery, while the Laz Gun is a versatile rifle for medium range encounters. A heavy, the demolition armor is a heavy armor equipped with an auxiliary missile launcher system. This rare power armor variant was tailored specifically to the need of inquisitorial retinues in need of fire support in desolate, isolated environments. Also equipped with a frag grenade dispenser belt. Ooh. Full on destruction, versatility, or tank, basically. Man, this thing just looks cool. I like the idea of hacking through some enemies. Huh. Yeah, I'm thinking about it. But these two right now are the two that most appeal to me. Odds are I'm going to try both uh, specializations uh, at some point. So, I don't know. Let's start with... Hmm. Let's start with the Assault Gunner. Let that be our first character. Background Crusader. Let's do this. You know, let's create another character real quick, because we already know what we want. Uh, I have absolutely no idea. Uh, let's go with this. It's a name I've used in single-player RPGs in the past. Let's go with this. Uh, yeah. Let's play this particular Crusader. Let's hope the load times are not insanely long. And let's hope there's a tutorial, because I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Okay, the game now employs a crash report mechanism. In case of errors, we send anonymous. Okay, I don't care if you... Yeah, I really don't care if you take on... You know, take data. Okay, so it does so far control just like you would imagine. Uh, inoculator, huh? What do you do? Uh... Restores 10% of max HP, so you're basically selling me healing items. Gotcha. Uh, what do you sell? Ooh, better weapons. Nice. I can't use any of this, can I? Like, I can't use these two, right? These are only available for the big dude. Okay. Okay. And you just salvage materials. Great. 
I'm gonna have to do a lot of research to figure out how the hell this works. Uh, support. Well, let's go to ranged combat. Maybe not sniper. Single DPS? Hmm. Let's start with that, I guess. Works for me. What is our gear? Inventory. Are we armed at all? Laz pistol. Pair of Laz pistols. I thought we could use one of each. Oh, no. The auto gun instead of an auto pistol. All right. Cool. Cool. Okay. I still have no bloody clue how to play, but we shall, you know, figure it out by actually going to the star map and killing some assholes. Actually, what's this? Storage? Yeah, we have shit in storage. Let's look around the ship a little bit more. Wow, this place is this place is really cool looking. Exterminate 250 rebel engines. Okay. If I may find them. Also, this game is multiplayer and co-op. I just saw that little thing in the corner. But I've never played before, so maybe let's not drag down a team. Okay, Tenebra Subsector. The subsector includes some of the oldest worlds in the sector. Some of these planets were colonized as early as the Dark Age of Technology. Others were claimed during the Dark Crusade or the Great Crusade. As the region is relatively free from the infamous Caligari warp surges. The lack of the extremely predictable, unpredictable warp storms allowed a lengthy period of growth and progress. For a considerable amount of time, the core Tenebra worlds remained relatively peaceful and important, far from the great clashes in the galaxy. But the shift in power structure in the expanding sector eventually left the forgotten subsector overlooked and forgotten. Wow, I think I said forgotten way too many times in there. Uh, the Tenebra subsector is rich in ancient technology and also has its fair share of shadowy corners where am I? can I click on any of these or nah I can only click on this one okay let's travel to the subsector that's kind of cool I have no idea what any of this means protector Helden Maybe go to the one that's at the lowest, Challenge 125. An empty dead system which has been isolated from the Imperium for at least 2,000 years, although Imperial records have no trace of the system at all. Strangely, the solitary planet orbiting... Uh, let's see. Strangely, the solitary planet... Sorry, I was reading the, the chat. Uh, strangely, the solitary planet orbiting the strange stars bears the marks of Imperial presence somewhere in the past. The system is an enigma and a dangerous lure to rogue traders and adeptus mechanicus explorators. Uh, sure? Uh, can I just kill shit? Holy crap! There are a lot of different places. Oh, placeholder. <laughs> Charkov. Are there? The southern... Ooh, all these are... Okay, now we here. Okay, cool. The southern mining cities produce rare minerals, but it's not what makes this backwater world interesting. In the north, stalagmite-like monolith pillars jut out of the crystalline deserts, and humankind made its home high up on these crags. Like birds building haphazard nests, the region had spawned several cults in the past, like the screaming prophets of the crawl, so the Caligari Conclave keeps an eye on this planet, trying to learn what might cause this plague of heresies from time to time. Let's start with... Don't know why my dogs are going off. Sorry about that. Should we go with the priority assignment? You know what? Let's, let's go after the Purge. Let's go after the Chaos Legion Vanguard. I'm assuming the number value is the difficulty. And I don't want to jump into a very difficult one right off the bat. Negative 29% damage dealt, plus 30%. What the? F that doesn't sound cool. 
Uh, Fork-tongued enemies of the Imperium are hiding in a herd of Chaos worshippers, claiming an industrial complex as their own, offering salvation to all who embrace the touch of the warp. Yeah, don't listen to that shit. The local Arbides are in dis disarray, and the masses are mesmerized by the call. Break the evil influence, whatever the cost. Kill the cultist, kill the demon engine, kill the chaos engine, kill the stationary weapons, and the chaos marine. We have to exterminate everything. That sounds like fun, actually. Can I go kill it? Ooh, left click on the ground. Yeah, no, that's, that's pretty obvious. Arrow keys to move around if I prefer. Thank you. I really don't. But I would like to know how to kill shit. Press escape and click on the tutorials button in the menu. Uh, cool. I'm gonna look at this real quick. Movement. Uh, oh, I just move whenever we see the arrows, that's fine. Switch between with tab. Left click and right click on the enemy. Okay, so we use the number keys to use special skills. Left click and right click for various weapons and tab to switch. Hold, press and hold space to get into cover behind objects. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't even know there was a cover system. Yeah, like that. Let's test out our weapons real quick. Three round burst. Full auto. Cool, is there a reload option? There is, just press R. All right. Let's go kill some shit, shall we? Hey, guys. Nope, get over here. Oh, this is fun. I like cover-based games. It just seems more realistic to me than, like, you know, dive right in. And considering we're not supposed to be a space marine... Ooh. Hey, dude. I am going to just unload on this Chaos Champion. Okay. I need to get away. <laughs> I really need to get away. Okay, I tried to use that skill. Okay, we need to get the hell up out of here. Quickly. Very quickly. Okay, we are going to use this skill. Okay, get into cover. We are recovering. Yeah, that space marine sucked. Okay, so. What are our specials? I should probably look at this. That works. I should have used that on that dude. Cool. Now what does this do? Aim shot. Yep, killed him. Now let's look at our specials over here. Shoot and retreat. And aim shot. Okay. And a stun mine. Oh, and number four would have deployed the turret, which would have been very useful. And this chat, I would really like it to go away. I will have to figure out how to do that. Well, maybe I can do it now. Options. Crash reports enabled. No, I'm okay with all of that. Is there no way to disable the chat on the left there? Hmm. Like, does 
that disable it? Because I would love that. Oh, no, I don't like that shit at all. Yeah, let's, let's do this. And... What the hell is with these little... Now, let's get back to our turret. Hey, guys. I really wish you would be pointing this way. <laughs> ah, son of a... Hell yeah. Yeah, let's focus on the havoc. Ooh. I got a new last gun. Oh yeah. Ah. So right click is what? A three round burst? Okay. And then we just alternate shots with that. Okay. That's good to know. Probably a good idea to learn the damn controls at some point. Using the arrow keys to move around for now. I wonder how well a controller would work for this game. Hey, dude. I'm gonna do this to you. And I'm gonna back the hell off because, yeesh. Hey, dude. Why don't you say hello to the turret? What the hell was that? You don't use a flashbang on me, you asshole. And there are a lot of enemies left according to that little icon on the bottom there. Uh, we are gonna... Whoa! Back the hell off. Yeah, we're gonna... go into full auto here and get away from that fucking oh that is awesome ah screw you guys okay I should probably be undercover for this I really need to use cover more often there we go yeah, our health is not doing so hot, but it's regenerating, so maybe I stand here and wait a little bit. Well, that would have been nice to know. Yeah, we're just gonna, we're just gonna sit here for a minute and just take these shots. Reload. There are so many enemies left. Ah, shit. Screw you. Well, nope. Uh-uh. I'm just gonna keep on strafing here. Probably should stop walking directly into the flame. Let's reload and switch then. And let's try to use this continuous beam thing. Bad idea. Okay. Hello. What are you doing? Okay then. I have no idea what that dude was, but... Well, that would have been useful. Ooh, a storage box. What, no loot for me? Come on now. Hey, guys. All right, let's back away before these guys actually kill me. Okay, there's a lot of marines. We're gonna drop another one of these. 
Well. Shit. Well, let's see about killing this one. Nope. I think we almost got him. I should not be able to go toe to toe with this dude like that, though. Like, honestly, going toe to toe with that dude should have resulted in my immediate death. I gotta say, though, I really enjoy the art style and the gameplay so far. Piss off, my head is not yours. Okay, I'd really appreciate if you just fuck off. Let's screw this guy. I'm gonna do this, then this, and then that. There we go. Piss off, dude. Yeah, I do have a health item. Okay, continue hunting. Really wish I could control my own camera angles. That's always been my preference in these types of games. What'd I get? Uh, not, sure, not sure I like that. Gonna do a little bit of sniping here. What the hell was that? Whoa! Hey, dude. Take that. Uh, focus him down, please. Up with you too, huh? Okay, deploy a turret. Okay, yeah, I should have been dead instantly trying to do that particular fight. I really want to see how well the not just how well, but I really want to see how the melee character performs. Come on, snipe them all. I really need to use my skills more. Like, honestly, let's... Uh... So let's move along. Piss off. Okay, that's a good weapon to use on these assholes. I am allowed multiple deaths, apparently. Hi, dude. Beacons. Oh, I see a big old space marine, oh, uh, chaos marine. Medical supply. I don't know that I need medical supply. I'll take it though. Ten inoculator, sure. What the hell's going on? Oh shit. 
I have to get out of here, apparently. This was a trap. Uh, what do I do? I just die, apparently. I just die, apparently. That is weird. Oh, I can shoot the security door. Well, that was stupid. Hi, guys. I'm just gonna chill in here. this apparently not anybody still alive in here oh hi guys hi enjoy the turret I'm gonna let that kill a couple guys you know unless Unless they, okay, unless they destroy the turret. Hi, guy. Gonna sh just, just gonna come through here and murder a couple of you dudes. And then run like hell. How? Asshole? Hey, give that shit a rest. I don't know what the hell just hit me. Hey, look at this. I can actually open this now, right? Nice. How long? Can't use it yet. Okay. Can't really hit him through. I can now. How you guys like it? Curse you, Inquisitor. That's a common enough um, sentiment, I guess. Hi, guys. I'm just going to use this for a while. And then it looks like I am going to have to do some running. I'm going to use another one. Fucker. Oh, he's a sorcerer. Who is not gonna stop chasing me, apparently. I'm gonna inoculate myself real quick. Leave me alone. Oh, hey, I can do a turret. Just murder this dude. Jesus. Damn sorcerer. Couldn't leave well enough alone. The hell? There's shit over here? Chests. What did I get? Oh, a lot of credits, apparently. Okay, we are resupplying. What's this? A room of skulls. Not uncommon. In 40k, but hey. Alright. Jesus, this place is all fucked up. As is every place in the 40k universe, really. Come all the way back here, dude. You did. I'm just gonna unload on you. Hope you don't mind. Oh shit. Hey, hey. Give that shit a rest. Fine. Da 
bastard sorcerer. Is that another marine? No. So we're just gonna murder you normally. That's cool. Dude's like disintegrating and shit. Medical supply, I shall take it. You never know when it'll come in handy. Give me the money. Ooh, we didn't kill the dude down there, and I would rather not mess with him quite yet. Yeah, no, I think the melee in this game would just be amazing. I'd love to be able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with these assholes. Ooh. Oh, that is cool. It doesn't do me any real good. What's this? Just some cool looking background shit. Gotcha. All right, well, I'm gonna come straight down the middle here and see what's out here beyond a couple Marines. Hi. Right. Enjoy. And I'm just gonna run around. Let the tarantula do its thing. Maybe not stand so close to quite as many explosives. Okay, that's bad. <laughs> Enjoy. How about this? Okay, that hit me too. Let's heal. Somebody's got a heavy weapon over there. Okay, I guess it's not really a heavy weapon. Oh, you're a cultist commander? What kind of bullshit is that? <laughs> We're just gonna keep on strafing. You are a champion. That is so not fair. Can I use another inoculation, please? I know I have several. Damn! to go like up to about right here deploy a turret on the move Let's try to kill this dude who's in our face some inoculations. Okay, I need cover. Hey, little bastard, get out of here. Okay, I can deal with these guys, I think. Oh, he's a renegade commander. Well, let's try to kill off some of the things back there with you. Ow! Inoculation. Are we finally down? Fucking hell. All right, let's explore this big old room for some resources, because Jesus. Uh, yeah, I'd like to see what I just clicked on, but I can't. There has to be, right? Controls. Ah, those are weird numbers for that. There we go. Much better for me. Hey, guys. Hey, 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 now. You guys need to quit it with that. Well, I'm gonna just 
do this. Hello, my cultist friends. I'm just going to murder you all in the little bottleneck here. You guys do just want to die for the glory of your chaos gods, right? Let me oblige you. Uh, I am not about to be your blood sacrifice. I appreciate the offer. I'm gonna take some shots at you. Kill streak. Well, it's not like there was a shortage of people to kill. Let's take out the teleporting beacon. Apparently overheat my weapon. Do that some more. Cool. Let my health regenerate before I go after these dickheads up here. Because there do appear to be a lot of them. The fuck was that? I heard some sound effects I was not at all a fan of. Unbound tribesmen, huh? Hey, guys. Enjoy. Enjoy my gift to you. Well, let's see if we can snipe this dude. Not with this gun, we can't. Ooh, that was useful. Hey, guys. I love the cover system. Puts a little bit more strategy into the game, I think, than your typical action RPG. So what's this over here? Just a chest? Okay. These are some pretty long missions, too, I gotta say. We'll destroy this thing eventually. Just give me a moment. gift. Oh, shit. You guys have gifts, too. I mean, no offense, but I kind of don't want yours. Good God. Can you get into cover, please? I'm gonna kill your buddies first. Flamer would be doing a lot more damage to me at this range. It still sucks. But hey. I will do what needs to be done. So I wonder. Is there another door on this side? Yeah, there is. Hey, there's a dude back there. How about I snipe you? Apparently, I am not any cause for concern. Screw it. Let's get your attention. Let's just do a continuous beam. Yeah, that flamer doesn't seem to be doing a whole lot to me. My weapons are overheated, though. That sucks. Ooh, we got a... We got an auto pistol. I do not want to venture into this. Apparently doing that was all it took to resolve the poison. All right, this is where we're at, okay. Jesus, there are so many little nooks and crannies in here, holy crap. 
big maps. Ah, oh, yeah, ass. Fine. Oh yeah, I am definitely on a kill streak. Ooh, that is even better for this. I just melt these little assholes. Hey guys. The thrice cursed Inquisitor. I'm not the cursed one here, you chaos bastards. Okay. I think it might be time to do this. Will you? That didn't work. That cover's getting in the way. Okay, we're gonna do this. Hey guys. Suck on that. I'm just gonna back up my turret for a few minutes. Another damn sorcerer. Uh, quickly. Use a healing item. Come on. Damn, he went down easy. No, no sacred murder. Just flank your dumb ass. Sacred murder. Cool, we got our supplies. We just need to find the rest of these assholes. Okay. I just like destroying these things, I really don't. If I can destroy it, I want to destroy it. And we are just gonna walk right here. And I am gonna back the hell up. Please get away from my damn turret. I repeat, get away from my damn turret. Hi. Who's hiding? Let's destroy some cover. I couldn't even see that. Ah, son of a bitch. Oh, there's two of you. Ah, but my turret's back here. I am not alone, you dick. Uh, how about I get undercover? Because apparently the Chaos Marine wants to focus on me. And not my turret. Which is fine with me. There we go. I think my turret's wrecked, isn't it? Shit. Well, let's keep using those healing items. They are being very generous with them. Hey, hey, hey. None of that shit. Oh, more of you little bastards. At least these guys go down easy. I mean, I guess they don't have far to go, but... Come on. Kill the cultists. You are no Astartes, but you can certainly fight it with them. Who the fuck are you? Nine enemies left. Okay. That looks like a lot more than- Oh my god, what the fuck is that? I'm gonna deal with all these little dudes first. I'm sorry, is that a- The battle is swinging our way. One last push and the victory is ours. Yeah, but are you trying to get me to fight a damn- No! Hell no! This asshole heals! 
hand summons little assholes. You are no Astartes, but you could certainly fight it, Mister. Yeah. Well, let's drain his armor, shall we? Ooh, let's put this here. The battle is uh -huh. our way. One last push and the victory. I'm is sorry, ours. he just counted as one. The Emperor protects. Something protected, Jesus. Oh no, there's a chest up here. I like how instead of just walking around, I just blew up the pillars. I mean, that's how this shit works, right? We gotta do it in the most badass way possible, I think. Uh, what's over here? Oh, warp gate. Yeah, maybe let's not leave this behind. There we go. I shall take the money. Or weapons, whatever. I'm easy that way. Is there like a map? Oh, they're all the way over there. Alrighty then. So we're just gonna leave this up for a little bit. Apparently it's just gonna be straight across the hallway here. Hi guys, I think I killed your leader. And your weird ass chaos dreadnought, it looked like. Straight across, right? Yeah. I mean, he wasn't all that tough, but, you know. <laughs> Hi, guys. Kill a couple of you assholes here. Oh, you're a commander. Oh, hey. I was wondering if there were going to be more of you. I'm just going to walk away. You know what I can do, though? I can also shoot through your damn defenses here. Maybe not the best place to hide. Oh, I'm overheating now. So I'm just going to snipe you from here, that okay? And apparently shoot through your... I like that, I didn't even notice that. I saw my... Today is a good day. Sure, I'll leave. What do I get for that? Because that was fun. I got a lot of loot too, I know I got better weapons, right? Anything better than my starting gear. Yeah, no, we got some loot. What the hell is this? Grand reward. Do I get all this shit or do I have to pick one? Purity seal, purity seal. Great sword. Nice. It's a lot of fun stuff. Alright, I want to look at my skills. We have an extra skill. Uh, yeah, let's continue making our ranged combat better. Okay, what's our auto gun at? Uh, well, first of all, let's switch you over. This auto gun is 48 damage and 70 ammo. Either of these are better. I'm sorry, what were those skills? Long shot, okay. Aim shot. Hmm. Huh. Can I actually equip the suppression shield? Because I thought that was only for that. Yeah, no, that's what I thought. I can do that. Should be able to equip a chain sword, right? Does that mean I can? No, I can use a sword and shield. All right, cool. I guess it's just the different armor I can't use. 
kind of like the idea of having melee weapons combined, like having both, so I might do that. Uh, purity seal. Oh, they go up here. Oh, that's a better purity seal. Eye implant. Ah, uh, we have a better one. And we have a better signum. Now, let's look at our weapons again. Hmm. Like, do I have to go with dual auto pistols, or can I just, like... It's a rare las gun. This one does more. Hmm. Oh, I can just have one in each hand, huh? Oh, that's how it works. I can no longer do the dual beam or shit because it's two separate weapons. I gotcha. But that one pistol, man, does more damage than... Yeah, almost as much damage as a rifle. Hmm. I will have to consider this. At least until I get another auto pistol. That's really cool, though. I en I'm enjoying this. Okay, we'll have to play around with our... Not that. We'll have to play around with our stats a little bit later. But for now, I am actually all out of time for today. So thank you so much, everybody, for watching. And if you enjoyed this video at all, then please, by all means, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, or any combination of those actions that suits you today. And with that, I will see you next time for some more Warhammer 40k Inquisitor Martyr because I actually really enjoyed that and I want to see what else this game has to offer. Thanks again for watching, guys.